Dry and chilly start to the day with wet weather moving in from the north, but the outlook turns drier. I'll have all the details of that and more coming up on Good Morning Britain. Who has got other things to talk about this morning? <laughs> She's all. Come on. I, know. I am going to dine out on this forever. Good. So, first of all, I love John Bon Jovi. We know this. It was my chosen subject for Mastermind, and he was on this morning yesterday. So Ben texts me and you dreamed of. Yes, everything. Good. Sorry, I, I was carry on. really close to you know wanted to give him a big old hug and kiss, but I didn't. But then, <gasps> the Bon Jovi have a new documentary out, 40 yeah. Years of Bon Jovi. It's Thank You, Good Night. The premiere was last night. And I went to the red carpet last night and I got to interview him. Oh. Wow! So I said, oh, your hands are really cold. And I said, I can't feel a thing. I just was just like... <laughs> so exciting. So, yeah, it was Did amazing. Did you agree to leave your husband? There's a VT later on with Richard Arnold. <laughs> and um, he, bon, John Bon Jovi and the band caused the first argument in my marriage <gasps> after I got married. Um, and so then we agreed we'd leave our partners and we'd get married. And he said yes. <laughs> Put it on oh, brilliant, tape. Brilliant. Put it on tape. I find, okay. this, I find this all complete. <gasps> Oh, I'm just going to pull back a little bit. Oh, my God. I mean, pull back. <laughs> Cer okay. Certainly not when you were a teenager. I mean, who sings Living on a Prayer? Me? Unless it's after 11 oh, at night. Oh, no. And Everyone. In the karaoke room. I don't know what it is. Andy, you've got the leather on today. I think you may be slightly making my point. Ed. Tell you what, he's got a nasty... Like, wow. Even Vicky, our floor manager, who never <laughs> looked... He's oh. riling Laura in that way, can you? No. John Bon Jovi, a cool... Uh, Ed, what were you listening to in 1986? It was so much cooler. Um, the house smart. Oh, you've offended all of us. It's only Ramvin. <laughs> Is it going to rain? Here's the details. <laughs> I guess we're all here to see if you're going to have a nice day and I'll have a full Bon Jovi weather forecast for you later on. But for now, it has all changed. It starts off fine and dry first thing this morning, but then it clouds over, turns wetter and windier. So this is how it looks right now. Clear skies for England and Wales, but that means it's a chilly start to the day, but it's clouding over already across Scotland and Northern Ireland. So as we head through the day, a band of rain moves across Scotland and Northern Ireland and then slowly into northern areas of England. The rest of England and Wales is largely fine and dry, just clouding over across the north later. So in the sunshine with light winds, 15 degrees shouldn't feel too bad. But further north with the cloud and rain, 10, 11 degrees, fairly disappointing. The whole band of rain slips its way southwards tonight. So a legacy of cloud in the south means a greyer start tomorrow, but a milder one as well. And tomorrow is one of sunshine and showers. We've been there a fair bit as we have been through the last few days. And again, in the sunshine, 14 or 15 degrees should feel very nice indeed. Good morning to you. Another chilly start to the day and then some rain moves in, but actually the outlook turns drier. Why? High pressure is moving in. High pressure acts like a force field. It keeps weather fronts at bay and it generally, as we head through the next few days, works a treat, but it does bring with it a lot of cloud. So let's how things are looking for today. It, yes, it will be dry and brighter in the south, but then it turns wetter and cloudier across the far north. So for England and Wales, it is clear and dry initially. Beautiful sunshine greets you, bit of a chill in the air, but I think a price worth paying. For Scotland and Northern Ireland, it is cloudy and then the rain is arriving. So the rain first thing across the northwest of Scotland, moving across the whole of Scotland within the next few hours, clearing through Northern Ireland. So brightening process here by this afternoon, but later on this afternoon, North Wales, northern England, then the North Midlands start to see this cloud and rain arriving. So a disappointing, dull, damp day across the northern half, but staying fine, dry and bright in the south. And temperature-wise, we're looking at 14 or 15 degrees. So in the sunshine with light winds, feeling very nice indeed. How do things pan out as we head through the next seven days? Well, let's take a look as compared to average. Well, actually, doesn't know that's working at the moment. I'll take you through it with my weather graphics here. OK, it looks like it's working.